for all of us that were involved in the first production, you know, it was something that that we were hoping to get to this place, right? This is, quite frankly, my first sequel, which is an amazing thing in this market and how hard it is to get movies made. What's even more satisfying is this is also Denzel Washington's first sequel. Here we have the one of the greatest living actors of our time and generation, and he's never reprised a role twice. Now we have the opportunity to uh, see where Robert McCall has gone from the first one and how he is even driven more now to use that superpower, right, his heroic gifts, um, to help even more people. And that's what's really exciting about the sequelizer, as we're calling it here, is to see um, how he's evolved and where he's able to now go to in this new picture. He is the equalizer, right? He's accepted that mantle. He's embraced the position he's in. Um, and there's so many more people that need to be helped, right? And so this is not just a retelling or a rehashing of an original story. This is taking that story and showing where it is evolved into. We had an opportunity here to, once again, now bring a plot point into the sequel um, that did two things. Move the story forward and created a new villain, which is what you always need in these movies, but also help us define backstory. What happened? How did they get here? How, who is he in all those things? So it's rare that you find a plot point that can do both as a producer and especially someone who helps create story on a day-to-day -day basis. You're trying to always move a story forward. Here, though, we felt an had been told by the audience that they still wanted to know some things from the past and we were excited to be able to fill in those blanks. And so I think we've done a really good job in the sequel of giving the audience backstory information that they wanted and a drive of plot story forward that keeps them on the edge of their seats. Now I really hope that they see in Robert McCall an evolved hero someone who has accepted the responsibility to help people. And I really do, and I know it's just a movie, but it's almost like a pay it forward kind of situation. I want more people to help more people. And I know it sounds simple, um, but it's getting harder in the world we live in to just help someone. And when you feel as if nobody's helping you, I want them to always believe that there's a Robert McCall for them somewhere. And so hope is important. We need a lot more hope in the world. Um, I hope Robert McCall touches lives in a way that creates more Robert McCalls. But I also hope people don't feel hopeless because there are people out there that truly do care. Um, and this is just a story of one of them.